to put in our own anchor text automatically. So I've now got eight articles. I have my article settings completed. We only need, the, need to complete the article, feed and social settings once. We use the same accounts over and over. We've already created our accounts on the free sites. We've completed this information in our settings window. We're all done. All you need to do is check all the boxes. And we click on start and the software to distribute that information to the 100 plus websites that we use in our software will take anywhere from 50 to 70 minutes depending on how many articles you have. That's all you need to do. This project is ready to go. I just press start. About eight times throughout the process there will be captures need to be presented. You can, after you press start you can shrink the software and it will just go off on its way creating all these sites. I suggest you watch it for the first couple of times so you can see what it's doing. If the software requires you enter a capture it will give you a coughing sound so you can come back to the computer and enter a capture. Okay so we'll say that we've done this project. A really easy way to reuse these articles if you've added eight articles of your own or you found eight articles you can click on this dare button and run this whole project again though creating some new accounts here. What the dare button does, the software is intelligent in that it changes the structure of the articles so in the eyes of Google they are totally different articles. They will read the same on page though in Google's eyes or Googlebot's eyes they are totally different articles so you can then run the project the pretty same much pro the same project but run it again on a whole completely different set of free sites sending you tons more backlinks <coughs> excuse me if you check that off and check it again these articles have been changed again I will now go back to bed and try and get my voice happening correctly and get well I just want to show you how simple it is to use the software and in an hour you can achieve with brute force SEO what it normally takes you a week to do by hand. Getting back to why you need to record the RSS feeds, once you become a member of the brute force SEO all is revealed even if what I teach to, to my members is how to create an SEO backbone that will last you for years and years and years. Even if you remember for just one month you will get massive benefits from this SEO backbone. Thanks for listening and I'll see you in the next video.